technology is smart, so are we. The quadririte is strong, just like our physical strength. Technology is sensitive, so are our feelings. We are women in AI. In DabaX, women in machine learning, IWIML. The Indaba X Namibia has been hosted for the past three years and the event has helped uh, create awareness and sharpen the skills of our participants in deep learning and data science. My experience with the hackathon last year was one of the best. I got the opportunity to go to MTC which was a dream place for me. I've always wanted to be there and the fact that we are given data to explore and it was directly in the for a whole one week and we had the chance to have some of our own lecturers helping us with the work. It was beautiful. Our participants have had the opportunity to learn about um, innovations and applications in the field of deep learning. And our participants have not only been um, exposed to theoretical aspects of deep learning, but they've also had the opportunity to have hands-on practice during um, the X workshops. Our event includes everyone from the AI and ML community in Tunisia. So, whether you're just a beginner who's setting his first steps into the field, or you're more advanced and looking to improve your skills and widen your network, or even if you're just someone who's curious about the latest advances in the field, everyone found what they're looking for in our event. And the highlight of it all was the fact that we were given the opportunity to talk to people and ask questions during the meetings, which was marvelous and the lecturers and the, the, the participants that were there were actually allowing us to be ourselves and allowing us to ask questions, allowing us to explore what they're doing into the real world. And what makes these meetings very, very special is that um, there is an Indaba spirit behind them. So it's an idea not only to have a conference, a scientific conference, but also to kind of ask difficult questions about how Africa can engage in machine learning and artificial intelligence, especially because these topics will very much define the future of many, many societies and also African societies. The machine learning and artificial intelligence community in South Africa and Africa is still relatively small but growing really, really quickly. Um, and so this event is part of a whole series of events all over the continent. Um, in an effort to bring all these subgroups of people together, both researchers and industry practitioners and students, um, and to both grow and strengthen this community at the same time. I did see a lot of very brilliant um, research here as well, and it's very motivating and very inspiring. And I think one of the biggest things I'm also taking out of this is being able to get feedback from other researchers and people who are interested in doing the same type of work and getting some proposals of how I can extend my research, add more data to it from the experts over here. I really, really hope that these two things will come together where you'll see a lot more academics working with people from industry to solve big problems in Africa. I mean, I personally think that Africa is a really good place at the moment just because of all the options or like all the opportunities for people to apply machine learning. There are a lot of people that are sort of dis are separated from the rest of the world and like don't get the chance to experience the value of these kinds of technologies. So I think by helping bring these technologies to these sort of smaller communities where they really can use it to, for base level things like optimizing water or things like that, they really can benefit the most from these kinds of cool technologies. Um, clearly we have a lot of skilled individuals in Africa and I think if we collaborate together we can really grow our continent and it's, it's not just about, I mean AI is really broad term, so it's not just about us growing Africa, by growing Africa we grow the world. But it's nice to see that a lot of the same people are here but also there are so many new people that are here and I think that speaks to how much more accessible AI is becoming and also how much more accessible these types of conferences are because they're offering like funding and making sure that people get the opportunity to engage um, with, I guess, their colleagues. To 
join the Indaba X Women in Machine Learning, reach out to the Indaba X call contacts in your country or send us an email to indabax at deeplearningindaba.com. We build together.